regulars here. Five dollars a month. How do you have hours of time to watch me and not five dollars? I don't know. What are you doing with your life where you have hours of time to watch Twitch and not five dollars to provide for the content that you're watching? This charming individual is Bad Bunny. She's a self-entitled bitch slash Twitch thought that you may have heard of before, probably down to the fact that last year she made some quite controversial remarks about how people that watch her content on Twitch and don't subscribe to her are leeches. Like, how do you think free entertainment is available to you? It's because other people actually provide money so you can be a cheap ass. That's the reality of it, period. Period. If you're watching Twitch as a non-donating, non-sub, you are leeching. Well, guess what? She's back. And guess what? She's still a bitch. Massive surprise. She is, for those of you who've not heard of her, like a female DSP. While we're on the subject of DSP, I know I said that this vi next video was going to be about DSP, but I have to make this video because I, I just had to when I heard this shit. I had to make a video on it. The DSP video is, it's been made and I'm in the middle of editing it. It's quite a long one, so that's why. But it will be the next video, I promise. In fact, there's going to be two DSP videos, uh, one after the other. So, yeah. Anyway, on to uh, this situation here. Like I say, Bad Bunny is a self-entitled bitch. And, yeah, she basically thinks that her viewers, if they're not paying her, they're leeches. And she's up to her old tricks again basically she was streaming and she sort of it was brought to her attention that over an hour had passed and nobody had subscribed or donated any money to her and ex chat i haven't got a donation or a sub for an hour what the fuck for an hour what the fuck? An hour when I fucking working for free? What the fuck? <laughs> you must be kidding, aren't you? An hour and I've been working for free. I hope this goes without saying, but I used air quotes when I said working. An hour working for free. This bitch has 93,000 followers on Twitch. Let that sink in. You live on the same planet as 93,000 fucking morons and Bad Bunny. You live on the same planet as these fucking people. What a, what a fucking time to be alive. And Bad Bunny's work, if you want to know more about what uh, kind of stuff Bad Bunny does on Twitch, you should check out GG Reloaded's videos on her uh she's got quite a few and they're very very good very funny very informative um she basically watches other people's youtube videos on stream and air quotes reacts to them Uh, she can also do other things, like she'll eat a packet of crisps on stream. And you can watch her eat. Uh... As far as I tell, she doesn't play games on Twitch, mate, but even if she does, wow, you play video games on Twitch. I had a quick look at her Twitch channel. Couldn't see anything. So basically, her talent is being a girl. Oh, yes, being a girl, my favourite, my favourite fucking talent. Let's give her all my fucking money. Oh, it's, and of course, I'm going to say it, you know I'm going to say it. It's the male horny virgins that allow this to happen, right? All you incels that give money to, to her... For being a girl, because that's what you're giving when you're like, oh, she might sleep with me, she might be my GF. That's how people like her are able to exist. What other period in time...
do you know, other than right now in history, that someone, like a girl, anyone, could make money off of watching YouTube videos and eating crisps and filming that? What? I'm not being funny. There's periods of history where if, you know, when we were out hunting for food and all that sort of stuff and building shelters, if you had Bad Bunny in your tribe or whatever... And she was like, oh, I'll just, you just guys just watch me eat for entertainment. No. Do you know what happened to her? She'd be clubbed on the head and she'd be eaten. Yeah. <laughs> the fucking lazy bitch working. Give me a fucking break. This is unreal. How did my whole speech about how I need subs to get the stream going if you like the content, blah, blah, blah. How that result in zero subs? There are regulars here. Five dollars a month. How are you have hours of time to watch me? And not five dollars. I don't know. What are you doing with your life where you have hours of time to watch Twitch and not five dollars to provide for the content that you're watching? Because it's like people just really have no, they really don't respect me as a content creator. Don't respect you as a content creator. What content that you create do you want to be respected for? Oh, eating crisps. Oh, what a fucking legend. Oh, look, she's watching a YouTube video. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, sorry, man. We totally should have respected you. Also, like, the way she opens, she's like, how the fuck did my speech about needing subs for, um, in my content to continue, how did that not get me any subs? Well, how, oh, how did my little rant on how I need subs and I'm begging people to give me money, how did that not, oh, I, I fucking, I don't know. Maybe because some self-entitled fucking bitch moaning about the fact that she needs money to eat crisps and sit around reacting to people's YouTube videos doesn't go down so well. Maybe that's why it didn't garner you any subs. And for God's sake, I love the way as well she's like, um, oh, how the fuck have you people got loads of time to watch me on Twitch, but you don't have five dollars to give me? Don't fucking question shit they're not the ones that should be questioned i mean yeah they should be questioned the fact that they've got hours to watch your stream i mean surely those hours could be put to better use jesus christ maybe like seeing how many times you could bash your head against a wall before you pass out would be more productive i i honestly don't know yeah but the people you should be questioning is who is giving you five dollars they're the people that are fucking crazy five dollars a month to this fucking talentless hack so that she can live life on easy mode. Get paid for reacting to other people's fucking content. How is this allowed? This is so stupid. And if... Yeah, great. Okay, we live in a fucking world where people can make money on Twitch reacting and stuff. Great. But do you want to be a little bit more fucking grateful, you fucking self-entitled bitch? You're in a very privileged, pri privileged position. I have a full-time job. Right? You don't hear me coming on here like moaning or going around my job moaning going, Oh, why do you expect me to work? Why do you... Oh, fucking hell, man. Honestly, it must be so nice to be a female on YouTube and Twitch and do that sort of thing for a living. If this is your biggest fucking problem, Jesus Christ, if you had a taste of the real world, you would fucking die. It is shocking, but she does genuinely believe, like, like Susie Lou, like DSP, she does believe that what she's doing is actually hard work. The str struggles of streaming are very unique to streaming and you can't understand them if you're just looking at it from the outset. The struggles of streaming. The str you use the word struggles. I've taken shits that have been more struggling and difficult than fucking streaming. Jesus Christ. All oh, the struggles of streaming. If you had to get a real, imagine if this bitch had a real job, man, she would die. She would literally, and I don't mean that as like an exaggeration, she would fucking die. It's easy for you now, but it's the journey that is hard. I, what did I just say? What did I just fucking say, dumb nuts? What did I just fucking say? I literally just said, you won't understand the unique difficulties of this job unless you experience it yourself. And then you're like, well, no, your job's easy for you now. What did I just, are you fucking dumb? How are you this fucking stupid? You're asking them how they're this fucking stupid. How are you this fucking stupid that you're antagonizing a chat full of, like, male horny virgins that are giving you money? You better hope that these male horny virgins that support your lifestyle and pay for your content don't discover Pornhub. You better fucking hope, because that shit is free. And they're <laughs> those girls on there are giving way more than you are fucking eating a packet of crisps. I don't know who's, like, fucking subscribing for that shit. 
Jesus Christ. It's you are so lucky that there are so many incels like looking for for content on Twitch. What happened to Twitch? Why is just chatting a thing? Remember when it used to be about games and you could go there, watch some quality content, see the latest games being played and stuff, and now you can literally just go and watch a girl sit down and watch someone else's YouTube videos and barely react. What the fuck? What has happened to, air quotes, entertainment? Remember back in the day, like, oh, we're going to the theatre to watch some Shakespeare 2020. Whoa, oh, what are you doing tonight? Oh, I'm going to watch Bad Bunny eat a packet of crisps, cheese and onion tonight. Fuck off. Oh, anyway. So, like I said, her attitude is super toxic. And most of you probably already know. But last year, she had some, um, some thoughts that she wanted to give to people that were viewers of her streams, but weren't paid subscribers. How are you consuming this free entertainment? Again, how can you call what you do entertainment with a straight face? I'm fucking sorry. Eating crisps and sitting down reacting to videos is not fucking entertainment. Jesus Christ. Oh, but I'm a girl. Oh, who gives a fuck? Jesus Christ. How are you consuming this free entertainment? Like, how do you think free entertainment is available to you? It's because other people actually provide money so you can be a cheap ass. That's it. Other people provide money. Because they're they're generous and they they, they see like a thing that they want to support, a form of entertainment they want to support, and then you leech. But don't don't it, that's the reality of it. Period. Period. If you're watching Twitch as a non-donating non-sub, you are leeching. If you're watching Twitch as a non-donated sub, you are leeching. Bitch, you are so fucking dumb. Considering that you work on Twitch, you should know a bit more about the fucking site. Twitch is, like, fucking there. It's free entertainment. Paying for your shit is optional. If you wanted to start a air quotes business on Twitch, you should fucking know that it's not guaranteed. I could come and watch all your fucking shit, not that I would, for free, and you couldn't do a damn thing about it. So, like... You're fucking stupid, and to sit there as well and go, oh, anyone who's not subscribing or paying or whatever, it's the people that are paying the reason this, air quotes, entertainment exists, because they're generous and blah, 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 and they want to support this because of their generosity. They're not generous, they're fucking male horny virgins that fancy you, and they think that one day, maybe you'll fucking have sex with them. But it'll never happen, no matter how much money you guys donate to her, and it's the reason, you're the reason... That people like her exist. We can be mad at her all day. Yeah, she's a, a fucking spoiled brat. She's self-entitled. But she shouldn't be allowed to exist. This, she should be like, right, oh, what are you going to do for a living, Bad Bunny? Well, I'm going to um, film myself reacting to videos and eating crisps. Oh, I don't think that's going to work out very well. Oh, it will because I'm a girl. Okay. And then she should start her stream and get zero viewers and be like, oh, shit, what the fuck? What's that? Oh, all the male horny virgins have got some self-respect. Now she doesn't exist. Thank fuck. Obviously, that's not going to happen. But in an ideal world, that is exactly what would happen. Period. If you're watching Twitch as a non-donating non-sub, you are leeching. You are leeching. Now, GG Reloaded pointed out in his videos an excellent point, which is she's here saying that people that are watching her streams and not giving her money are leeching. Yet on her streams, she reacts to other people's YouTube videos but she has ad block on. So she's leeching off of other content creators. People are watching her watch entire YouTube videos with the ad block on. So she's watching YouTube videos with ad block and the people that made those YouTube videos aren't getting a penny off of her. Yet she is making money off of their content. So she is literally leeching off of their videos. So she's leeching while lecturing other people on leeching. Oh, I'm leeching off of these YouTube content creators, but don't you dare fucking leech off me, you fucking cunts. What the fuck, man? What? How do people have this attitude? Um, poor. Wasn't trying to harass. I'll stay quiet. No, nerdiful. You're not listening. You're getting defensive. I'm saying that if you're going to constantly tell the streamer to look up things on your behalf because you personally want the streamer to do things for you, First of all, that's not a thing that you should be doing in a stream because it's just kind of rude. If you're thinking that we have this type of relationship in which I do your bidding for you, and the fact that you haven't invested $4.99 in me 
because I do this full time and I'm sure you know that by now. It says something about you as a person. What an unbelievable cunt. I mean, she is the, the biggest spoiled brat going. She is just like a female DSP. But the thing is, she doesn't get as much shit as DSP. And do you know why she doesn't get as much shit as DSP? Because she has a vagina. If Phil was doing this, oh my god. That he'd be destroyed, and rightly so. But because she's got a vagina, she doesn't get nearly as enough shit as what she should. Here, she's like literally this guy, or whatever is saying, giving her links of videos to watch. People are putting links in the chat saying, hey, since your content is you watching YouTube videos and air quotes reacting to them, any chance you'd watch this video and react to it? And she's basically like, you ain't my boss. You think I'm going to do your bidding? Like, what? what the fuck? You, do you not run a business? Are these people not your customers? Like, in your mind, if this is a job, then surely these people are your customers and you've got to keep them happy. But no. And then you get arsey again, like, people have not done it in for $4.99. Oh, no one's giving me $4.99 a month for watching games and uh, fucking videos and eating crisps. Jesus Christ. How is... I eat crisps every day at work on my lunch break. I don't film it. Am I loot missing out? I'm eating crisps for free all this time. Jesus. You guys are making me really bummed out right now. I'm actually not in the mood to fucking talk to you guys right now. We got dude in the chat here that's like, sorry that you want money. Sorry that you need money to, to work and live. I can't believe I have to actually bring this up. Imagine if like every time you went to work, guys, you have to convince your employer to please give you money. And they always are like, wow, you're needy. And that's the culture. And they're like, well, I, I can just have you not. I can just fire you if you're going to keep asking for money all the time. I, I cannot believe the stupidity. I, I just can't fathom, like, oh. Like, me, for example, right? In my actual job. So, imagine if in my actual job, I had to say to my boss every day, can I have some money, please? And then he's like, oh, you're needy. No, you, you know, what fucking planet are you living on? I, my job, for example, I applied for, and I got the job, and I had a contract where I'm told, you're getting paid this amount of money each month. Do you know why? Because it's a real fucking job. I opted to go and get employed somewhere where they guarantee me money. A set amount of money every month. And these things, Bad Bunny, actually exist. They're called real jobs. Oh, you shouldn't say Twitch isn't a real job. Oh, come the fuck on. I'm not being funny. It's great that we can, that people can make money off of it. And hell, it must be nice to make money off of playing games and you know, reacting to shit. It must be nice, but look at this ungrateful bitch that's doing it. That's unbelievable. But yeah, you opted, you chose this life, right? And <laughs> you're, you're here going, oh yeah, imagine like having to beg your boss for money. It, you chose to use Twitch, which you knew going in that you're not guaranteed the same amount every month and you have to rely on the, like, the kindness of horny male virgins to keep you afloat and now you're getting fucking angry when you're not getting the money and people are watching it for free which they're able to do on this website that you have chose to work for i mean how are you so dumb how are you so fucking dumb i'm telling you man you do not deserve to have ninety-three thousand fucking followers your only talent is being female let me tell you some shit man let me let me quit my job and go on Twitch and film myself eating packets of crisps and reacting to shit. And let's see how long it takes for me to end up on the street begging to give people hand jobs behind fucking Greg's for a fiver. Let's see how long that takes to... <laughs> that was very specific, like... Um, but do you know what I mean? Like, it's literally because she's a girl, like, that she has... Um, is in this fucking position. And we, as a society, allow this to happen. And Twitch, as a platform allows this to happen. In an ideal world, she would be, like, in some shitty job somewhere, like, fucking having to work for a living. Not, like, getting mad at people because they're not giving her $5 a month to eat crisps. People eat crisps everywhere, bitch. I eat crisps, like I say, every day at work. I watch YouTube videos every day. No one gives me a penny for it. Do you know why? Because it's not fucking work. Anyway, yeah, there you go. Well, that was Bad Bunny, guys. <laughs> She's a great person. Um, so, yeah, what are your thoughts on this absolute fucking loser? If you want to know more about her, like I say, you should check out GG Reloaded's videos. He's done a few on her. Thank you very much for watching, guys. The DSP videos will be coming soon. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers, guys.
just might lie wide awake in fear and let time pass by. No, I can't see clear. Think I'm lost inside, and the end is near. It's just not fair.